So he's a trained pianist. And what he's what he's doing here is playing Fly to the Bumblebee on on Kush. Yeah, exactly. You know, this is a great demonstration of being used in a more maybe a, a traditional context in terms of the material, but very much utilizing that to be able to play things that would be in, incredibly difficult on another instrument just because of this layout. And he's playing that in the, crea in the chromatic uh, mode at the moment. Uh, oh, that's just him. Uh, this kind of stuff, I mean, this has been seen by a lot of people. How many keyboardists have seen that? I, I'm, I'm not sure of, but that's the thing. I think it's the, it's the traditional instrument uh, traditional instrumentalist who's coming to, to push and utilizing it uh, as just another instrument, not necessarily as like something that needs to replace their current instrument, but something that's an addition to their you know, creative tools. Because it, it, you, you can get very creative with this thing. Sure, you can use it in a more generic, controller way, but it also does work very much as an instrument, and it takes time to learn it and to play it. It's not something that you just jump on and can just play that easily. There is some kind of technique uh, to it.